We started Showcase Week here in 2017 to give our PhD students a chance to develop their presenting and public speaking skills. All third year students are required to give a 15 minute talk about their research to their peers and to the academics in the department. Being able to communicate your research clearly and effectively to other scientists and to the public is an important part of being a scientist. You can be carrying out the most amazing research in the world, but if nobody knows about it, what's the good in that? So I'm a third year PhD student in the Wheatley Group at the Department of Chemistry, and my research is in the synthesis of magnetic nanoparticles for some novel applications. So I'm at the end of my third year of my PhD, Last year, around this time for Showcase Week, I actually did a poster to show people the sorts of things that I was working on, but now I'm at the end of my third year, I have to escalate that a little and talk to an audience. It's very important to practice your presentation before you actually go and do it in front of a live audience. And I think the first time I did my practice talk, it took an hour and a half. So you put things together and you think, OK, I just want to show you one or two little things. And by the time you actually sit down and explain it, you, you've massively run over and you have to take a lot of stuff out. No, I haven't spoken to the entire department before. It's a bit daunting. Um, hopefully I'm going to keep them entertained. I would really like to, to show people what makes my project unique. I really like Showcase Week because it's pushing us to do something we wouldn't typically do. We wouldn't go out of our way to talk to the entire department. So we're learning new skills along the way and we're getting to share some of the things we've been working so hard on for the past three years. And sharing science means generating new ideas between people that wouldn't necessarily meet otherwise. So it's, it's very important and I'm looking forward to my talk. I think it went really well. I'm really glad that I got through it and I didn't really make any mistakes and I'm happy that it's over. We also ask all second year students to create posters about their research which gives them a chance to think about what they have achieved so far and to share their results with other students and researchers in the department. Posters are a really common way of presenting research and this is a crucial skill for all scientists to have. Researchers from the department will be judging the posters and the talks that fall within their research interest group, which could be biological, physical, synthetic, materials or theoretical chemistry. So I'm a second year PhD student in atmospheric chemistry, I'm in the Rhodes Jones group, and I'm working in the particulate matter, chemical composition and concentration in, in the atmosphere. So it's really important to study uh, what's the concentration of particulate matter in cities and everywhere we go, and particularly daily exposure to particulate matter. So far we have some monitoring station, we have one on the roof of this department. So what we need to do is use local sensors to give the people an estimation of what their, their daily exposure wherever they are and whatever they are doing. I'm preparing a poster uh, in which I'm looking particularly at the effect of the relative humidity on the uh, particulate matter measurements, which I showed the results of uh, an algorithm I came up with uh, that corrects for the relative humidity uh, influence on particulate matter measurements. It's very hard to let them understand why your research is important because they maybe they don't have the background. So it's very important to deliver the message and make sure that everyone can understand the importance of, of this research and how this affects our everyday life. Well, I'm disappointed that I didn't win the prize uh, because it took me a long time to prepare the poster and condense such a big amount of information in such a small format. Uh, but equally, it's the first time that I was producing and presenting the poster, so it was a good practice overall, and I'm sure that I can only learn from such a good experience. Uh, I also enjoyed looking at what everyone else is doing and the variety of their research. I'm really happy that I won because it meant the audience enjoyed my talk and could follow my research. 
I got some great questions and ideas from academics and other colleagues within the department and I enjoyed listening to other people's research. audience can um, can be much harder uh, sorry much easier <laughs> let's do that again <laughs> you're gonna sound like that man. <laughs> <laughs> in kind of everyday terms what does that mean <laughs> 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 let's pretend it's all over okay let's do that